What's up guys, Taylor here. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is winter fashion inspired. I wanted to show you guys some of the staple items that I wear throughout the winter because I live in Canada and it can get really cold here. It is really fun to express yourself through your fashion. These pieces really help spruce up my wardrobe, making me feel comfortable, confident, and also dressing for the weather, staying nice and warm, which is truly the most important. I've always been passionate towards fashion. It's a way of expressing yourself and it's fun to play around with different types of styles, trying to figure out what style suits you best. These pieces that I'm showing you are just a few of my very favorites that I wear throughout the winter time. So with that being said, let's jump into this video. Because it does tend to get very chilly here, I wear a lot of sweaters. First few items that I have are just some of my staple sweaters. This first one is an emerald green turtleneck. It has some lovely detail. I love the emerald color because it's not too bright, yet it adds a little pop of color to your wardrobe. So it's a very versatile sweater. And this one I believe is from Anthropology. This next item is another sweater. I find it's really important to have, even if it's not a super high turtleneck, just a lip of on your shirt is really important because I always get chills going through the back of my neck or the front. With this sweater, it has a higher neck. Detailing on these sleeves are absolutely gorgeous. It has detailing going down the arm and the sleeve is actually billowed. So it's a bigger sleeve and then it cuffs at the bottom, which I love the bagginess to it. It just adds a different aesthetic to the shirt. It sits right above your hips. So it doesn't actually sit as a crop top, which is really nice because if it was a crop top, it wouldn't be as practical for the weather here because it would be very cold. This sweater is probably the softest sweater I have ever owned. It is so comfortable. It keeps me so warm and it's cozy. I got this sweater from Princess Polly. The last sweater I have to show you guys is a cardigan. I'm a fan for the bigger billow sleeves that cinch at the bottom and this one does that. It is so cute, it's so flattering. You can button it up. It's very versatile with being able to wear so many different things underneath it. If I want to wear a turtleneck and then pop this on my shoulders, it's really nice. It's more of a fashion statement piece, one of my favorites. Moving on from the sweaters, the next pieces I have are shirts that I would normally wear underneath the sweaters. They're more like my layering shirts. So the first one that I have is just a solid black bodysuit. And this one was from Brandy Melville. And I love bodysuits, especially throughout the winter time because I find that they keep me the warmest because you're not having to worry about tucking in or anything. It's really important to have a solid black shirt and especially one that's gonna fit you nicely. It cinches you in and just complements all of your curves. This next shirt is a turtleneck. I have a turtleneck collection, especially if you're from Canada because it gets really chilly here. And like I said before, I like shirts that come up a little bit higher on me because I find they keep me the warmest. Use this one to layer because it's such a simple color. It has also some beautiful detailing on the arms as well as the bottom of it. It's just a cute little accent to the shirt. If I felt like I didn't want to just wear it plain, I would pop a sweater on so you would see just the collar. They can be dressed up to look very elegant and more formal, or you can keep them simple and keep them more as like a loungewear cozy outfit. This shirt was also from Aritzia. Moving on to pants. I wear a lot of neutral tops, and so I will have some fun with my pants. If you live in Canada, I think everybody should go out and try and buy a pair of leather pants. Uh, these leather pants are so warm in the winter time. I got these ones from Princess Polly and the seam line on them coming down the front is so form fitting and it really cinches you in and holds itself on your hip. I've never had a pair of leather pants that haven't slipped down and these ones do a perfect job of staying up themselves. They have a very cute detailed zipper on the back which is just another detail that I think elevates the pant. And these pants I got from Princess Polly. This next item that is a staple piece for me would be just a plain pair of blue jeans. Love the versatility that a pair of plain jeans can have. These ones sit right above your hips and I find that's the most flat form flattering for me at least. I got these ones from Zara. Just a straight leg boyfriend jean and I just love these pants so much. Moving on to jackets. So of course I have my winter jackets that I wear all the time. 
that keep me nice and warm. However, I like to introduce some type of pop of color. That is when I would usually wear this jacket of mine. I am obsessed with puffer jackets. They are just the comfier. I love this pastel blue. The color is so flattering. You can wear this with so many different colors, which I like, because it's very difficult sometimes to find a colored piece that will match with other colors. I got this one from Aritzia. Yet again, it is one of those jackets that I just know I will have forever because it is so comfortable and it is so warm. And that is exactly what I look for in a jacket when it comes to the winter. The next item that I have for you guys is this lovely long white jacket. More of a textured jacket. It just adds a lot to your outfit. And I usually wear a jacket like this if I'm going out for dinners or if I just want to elevate my outfit and make it a little bit more dressy. Obviously this one isn't as warm as the puffer jacket. I would normally wear a sweater or something underneath this and then add this on top. For the winter time, my main accessories usually are like scarves and toques. In my opinion, I think accessories can really make or break an outfit. I'll start off with this lovely toque that I wear. Pop of color can really add to an outfit, especially if I'm wearing like all black or like all white. Got this one from Aritzia. When it comes to accessories, I like to go a little bit more wild. I got this one from Aritzia and it is a thick, long scarf, burgundy and navy. It has a beautiful pattern on it and I love the detailing around the exterior edges of this scarf. I think that it is so beautiful. Super easy, super comfortable, super cute. I used to never wear belts because I didn't think I needed a belt. But as I got older, I realized that belts also add a lot of character to your outfit. And so even if you don't need one, I now wear it just for the look. Cause I find that it can tie in your shoes or tie in pieces of your outfit. So I have this cheetah print belt. If I'm wearing a simple outfit, I'll pop this on and it just adds something to the outfit. And I got this one from the same place I got my blue jeans, Zara. For me, in the winter time, I am usually wearing my winter boots, but when I like to go out, be a little bit more fancier and formal, I wear these boots. They are crocodile print and black. In the winter time, when my fingers are cold from being outside, I don't wanna have to tie up boots. And so I love these because they have the zipper on the side and I find that is so helpful and easy to quickly slip on, pop on and pop off. And I actually got these boots from Sheen and they weren't that expensive at all. And they were definitely a good find because they're good quality and they've lasted me a long time. I'm hoping that you guys feel a little bit more inspired when it comes to picking out your winter wardrobes now. If you guys have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. Give this video a big thumbs up. And if you have any comments, I would love to hear them. So please comment them down below. Have a great rest of your guys' day and I'll see you guys next week. Bye guys.